gosh. <laughs> I don't know what's wrong with me today. I just haven't got any get up and go. Oh. I think it got up and went. On my mark, get set. <gasps> Stay. <laughs> gosh, maybe I did. <gasps> maybe I'm a turtle and I'm stuck on my shell and I can't even roll over. Let's see. <laughs> Oh. Oh. Well, I'm definitely not a turtle. I'm me, and I'm glad. Oh, and boy, am I stiff. Oh, time to stretch. More like the speedy rabbit and not that slow old turtle. Yep, it's a brand new day, Molly. Hmm, what should we do today? Let's play. Oh, now where did I put that? Oh, hmm. Oh, no. Hmm. Ooh, what's this? steering wheel. Hey, this gives me an idea. Want to go for a ride in my new car, Molly? All right. I'll be the driver. Oh, first we have to put our seat belts on for safety. There you go. And there. Okay, seat belts on. Turn the key. Fix the mirror. And away we go! Vroom, 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 vroom. What's that you see, Molly? Molly sees a red light. That means stop! Gosh, what? I didn't know there was a duck cross in here. Huh. What do you see now, Molly? Molly sees a green light. That means go. Vroom, vroom. Love going for a drive, Molly. Uh oh. Oh, we're slowing down. Oh, oh, oops. Wave stopped. Ah, <sighs> we've run out of gas. Lucky us, we're at the gas station. Oh, I have to take my seatbelt off first. Now, let's see. Gas miss? Nice car. Just tell me when to stop. Should I stop now? Should I stop now? Stop 
Right you are. Tank's full. That'll be five dollars, please. Thank you. There we go. Well, drive carefully. Have a nice day. Oh, and buckle up for safety. There we go. And away we go. <sighs> I tell you, Molly, there's nothing like the open highway and a full tank of gas. This is the life. Oh, hey. Hey, Granny Babes. Yeah, it's me. Molly and me going for a drive in my fancy new car. Talking on my fancy new car phone. Huh? What? Oh, I shouldn't be talking on the phone while I'm driving? I need both hands on the steering wheel. Oh, right. Okay, thanks, Granny. Oh, Granny says I need both hands for driving. She's right. Hmm. Hey, Molly, could you turn on the radio, please? I need both hands on the wheel for driving. chase your baseball out into the road like that. It's very dangerous. Oh, phew. Oh, promise me you'll never chase your ball out into the road like that, Molly. Promise? Do you promise too? Good. It's very, very important. You have to be careful. You have to take care of yourself. Walking along with Till the green light says go, okay? Well, that's enough driving for today. Oh, and I have to go because someone's here for Miss Lunette's Dance Academy.
wonder who it is. It's a statue. And what a lovely position he's making. Let's try it. <laughs> it's easy to be a statue. Hey, let's play the statue game. Want to? It's fun. When I say go, you dance around the room. But when I say stop, you make a statue and don't move, okay? Here we go! Stop! Go! Stop! Go! Thought I should just check my mailbox. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, hey, here comes Major Bedhead. Let's surprise him. Package for Lunette. Package for Lunette the Clown. Package for Lunette. Is that you, Lunette? Are you a statue now? Ooh. A statue of Lunette. Boy, she's lucky. She must be famous. I wish there was a statue of me. <laughs> you make a great statue, Major Bedhead. I do. I do. Yahoo! We just finished playing a terrific statue game at the Dance Academy. That's why I was making a statue just now of myself. You were just playing a fun game of statue. Gosh, a fun statue game. Well, we could play it again. You can be the statue, want to? Oh, thank you, Lunette. Uh, how does this game go? Okay, when I say go, you dance and prance and jump around. Then when I say stop, you make a statue. Got it? Got it. Okay, ready? Ready. Set? Set. Go! Stop. Go. Package for Lunette. Oh, thank you. I wonder what's inside. Let's see now. Ah, my dear Lunette, I am having lots of adventures on my travels. Things have certainly been on the go. Surprises everywhere. 
they never stop. That's what traveling is for, surprises. And to discover new and different things to eat, and new and different ways to eat them. Of course, good manners are always important. But I'm sending you a surprise. Go have fun with it. My love for you never stops. Love, Auntie Macassar. A surprise? Oh, boy. Here, let... <gasps> hey, I have an idea. Help me in, Lunette. Okay, what are you doing? Sure looks funny. I'm a wind-up toy. Wind me up, Lunette. Oh, okay. There you go. I'll wind you up again. There you go. Hi, guys. Uh, are they with you? No, I thought they were with you. Da, 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 da. Uh, you made your bedhead. They think you're a toy. The world's biggest wind-up toy. Oh, so they do, Lunette. So they do. <laughs> okay, gang, follow me. Your bedhead gets so wound up sometimes. <laughs> okay, everybody in together. You in the back there, line up. Let's go. should turn on our reading lamp. It's important, isn't it, Molly? Okay, now, let's get comfy. Can you see? This story is called The Green Light Walk. Ziggy, the little puppy, heard a sound. Hooray! Mr. Lee is awake. Good morning, Ziggy. Isn't it a lovely morning? Hungry boy? But first things first, got to go. Ziggy and Mr. Lee had their breakfast, and every day after breakfast, Mr. Lee did his exercise. Now it's time you had your exercise too, Ziggy. Let's go for a green light walk. What's a green light walk? It works like this. We'll go for a walk together, but we'll let the traffic lights tell us which direction to go. Green light, go. Red light, stop. It will be an adventure. It will be fun. Mr. Lee wore his yellow rubber boots because it might rain, and Ziggy had his leash on to stay close to Mr. Lee. Down the steps and out the door and into the city, 
for their green light walk. Past the fire hydrant, past the pigeon, until they got to the corner. Which way should we go, Ziggy? The green light way. Green means go. Ziggy and Mr. Lee walked past the park, past the kids playing in the sandbox, past the bright, pretty flowers, and the fancy bird bath. The birds were having some splashy fun. They walked all the way to the corner. Which way now? Red one way and green the other. But wait, here comes the yellow light. That means wait. That means the lights are changing. Now it's red this way and green that way. Green light, go. Down the street they went, past a very noisy place. They were fixing the holes in the road. What a racket. At last they got to the corner. And another stoplight. Which way now on the green light walk? Green! This was a nice street. Cafes and fruit markets, lots to see and lots of things to smell. Mr. Lee bought a newspaper. And Ziggy, oh, he made a new friend. A green light walk was fun. Good boy, let's stop here. We don't need a traffic light to tell us when to stop. For a snack. So Ziggy and Mr. Lee took a coffee break at the cafe. Well, Ziggy had a water break because he liked water better. Time to go, Ziggy. Time to go home. And Ziggy and Mr. Lee walked all the way home. And of course, they were very careful to obey all the traffic lights. Red means stop, yellow means wait, green means go. The end. Oh, what a nice story. The green light walk. Did you like it? Did you like it? Good. Oh, I'm gonna go for a green light walk. Hey! Who made this big mess? I did? Oh, I did. Well, then I have to clean it up. It's only fair. Time for the 10 second tidy. Ready, set, green light, go! And now it's time for my quiet time. Here, Molly. You come under here. There we go. Well, thanks for dropping by. See you soon. Sweet dreams. the moon.